Hey, what's up? I'm Jason, and welcome to this episode of the Rhythm Recap. When I was about like in the fifth grade, I went to my friend's house where he was watching the movie Friday the 13th, and it scared the crap out of me. The very next day, I happened to be home alone, and I remember crawling under my bed and grabbing the phone and calling my grandma because I was so scared. The bottom line is that fear makes us do stupid things. Biologically speaking, when we are afraid, we do one of three things. We fight, we flight, or we freeze. And you see that over and over again in scripture, but especially in Peter. You remember when Peter's walking on water and he becomes afraid, he freezes and he sinks. Right after Jesus is arrested, Peter draws out his sword, the scripture says, and goes after one of the guards. He fights. And according to John, after Jesus is arrested, Peter and the rest of the disciples, they flee. They take flight. But recurring fear and anxiety, I think, does one more thing to us. It creates a fiction. It creates a fiction in how we see the world and how we see ourselves. Peter and the disciples do just what Adam and Eve do. They hid, just like what we do. We hide. We hide behind filters and fiction and pretend like everything is okay, when in reality, it's not. True faith, true courage, is the willingness to be vulnerable. It's the willingness to be authentic. It's the willingness to admit when something is wrong. Jesus invites us in to true relationship where you can be authentic and vulnerable and loved. Remember these powerful words that perfect love casts out fear.